Hello and welcome to a brand new video. Today we are playing the Callisto Protocol. Now, I've already done this intro about 5,000 times because I can't seem to stop getting desync and or issues with it in general. So I've had to go the extra steps just to make sure if things go bad and things go sour, I can sync it up. I've got Audacity running, I've got Logitech Capture running, and I've got OBS running. So no matter what happens, I can sync every video up. And from now on, because I'm fed up of wasting so much footage and time that I'm going to do this for every single video of mine. Just making sure that everything is running. Everything is running. And if I look a bit bright, I'll turn it down. Um, it's just because I have a ring light on my face at the same time and if because I'm looking that way It's because I'm looking at my computer making sure that everything is dandy and everything is working and everything is working Everything is dandy and I'm happy with that being said. Let's get into this and let's go Now I will say from the first like 25 minutes of me playing this game. It's it's impeccable like, <laughs> The gameplay is fun. Um, I will let you in on a spoiler. I died within the first 20 minutes of the game and I had my jaw ripped in half with my face removed. So if that doesn't tell you what kind of game this is, then I don't know what will. That's enough. We got a job to do. Roger, hangar control. Laying in course for Europa Station. Now, for my girlfriend who's who's behind me right now, she's probably going to get me uh, get very sick of me saying this, but this game is a beautiful looking game. I was watching that. He was watching it. It's it just was. I'm done talking about it. Then what do you want me to say? Oh, well, thank you. Because after this job, we're never going to have to work another day in our lives. Well, I guess you got it all figured out. Well, I guess so. Come on, man. What is this? Huh? Back and forth, Callisto to Europa, all this additional security. It's a prison moon, Max. They take the security pretty serious. And what about the attacks? Huh? How do you explain that? Well, by the outer way? They've been hitting targets all over the sector for the past six months. I got a yellow light in the cargo hold. That's probably not it. Well, it's still worth checking out. shouldn't worry so much, you know? You live longer. Now let's get into the game. For, I think this is like the fourth time I've seen this introduction. If you can't tell already, I'm quite fed up with the amount of issues that I've suffered just to record this first damn episode. And if I go through all of these additional steps, right, and it turns out it's fine. I'm gonna be pissed! But I hope everybody enjoys the series because I think I'm gonna enjoy it quite thoroughly. Because I've been nothing but excited to play this game. This better be worth the trouble. I've had it now for about a week. I've been trying to record for a full week. And all I've been thinking about is just like playing this game because it just looks so good. I hope the audio is fine. I'll put it a little bit closer. See if that um, that helps. I made a couple of modifications to my microphone, so I should sound quite bassy. Um, I hope so, anyway. Right. Let's mantle, shall we? Turn to the cockpit. Right, let's run. Let's go. Let's shimmy. This angle should look a little bit nicer, actually, because I'm using the software in Logicapture. 
should look, should look a little nicer. In once in post, um, I uh, change up how big I am on screen. It should actually take away a lot of the blurriness. Sure. Well, you can't see it, but I will. The uh, stretched image obviously often leads with blurriness, so hopefully I can have it looking nicer, everybody. Turn this off and keep looking that everything's running smooth. I'll just have audacity on in the background. That's paranoia in its finest. I kind of know that, like, just the way that this game is, it's, you're going to have a lot of these in the game. Where it's just heavy, reliant on your movement and your analog sticks. And if there's more scenes like this in the game, it's going to be so sick. So sick. Almost there. I literally reached my chair and then it just like stopped. control the ship like as you were going down that's kind of cool then that's a cool little feature that you can actually control where you were going So much pain, you'd like actually be in agony. One look of a human, you know, just the fact that one half of the face is just deteriorated and just melted off. His face is just like gone, just completely evaporated. Don't I know it? Those robots, though, are like something else. Like they are mean-looking robots. First ship I ever lost. We're boarded by. Let go of me. I hope at some point you get to fight. She's the one who. Oh, your chance, cargo jockey. You do your job. You let me do mine, all right? Sir. Yes, sir. I don't even remember if I did my intro, but hello and welcome to a brand new video if I didn't. Hey! I didn't do anything! 
the Callisto Protocol. Just, I'm, like, so glad that now that I can actually play this game, I can finally get to enjoy it. Because I've been waiting for so damn long to enjoy and play this game. Right, okay. Now we are officially in the game. The fuck are you looking at? Why? Way too quick. Shit. Okay, uh, inmates. Do not speak unless they are spoken to. Wait, there's been a mistake. My name is Jacob Lee. I'm not an inmate. You were inmate. 532-521. You address me as Captain Ferris. What? No, no, no. I'm just a cargo pilot. I was attacked by the outer way, by her. She crashed my ship and she killed my first officer. I don't care, Warden Zors. Oh, speak of the devil. Choice. Every choice in your life has led you here. So I think that's place, just do Hamel there, place. I think. The only place where you truly belong. I know he's like a famous Find actor though. I know that. that always been missing. A if you haven't already seen him, he's in the first Three Transformer movies, Together, I think. We will find that purpose. Welcome to Black Iron Prison. I just love that last part. Gives me chills every time. End of the line, get up. He surely like Inmates. has to be alive later right. on in the game. But right. like, there has to be here. something to do with him. Because you can't just make him like I know he's not really a central character, but you can't give him such dead. a purpose and then just kill him off. Dead. Just like you would have been if I hadn't fished you out of that wreck. I mean, shit. As far as anyone else is concerned, you are dead. It's time you moved on. Because you're crossing over to a new kingdom. No. My kingdom. No. So whatever it is you're holding on to right there, that's your old life. You gotta let that go. Because your new life entirely it's a bit of a uh, a naughty one let's go and now we are in the black iron prison it does look clean though I will say that it's very clean See, that just doesn't look like it'd rotate your shoulders. It just feels like they're just bringing them forward. So we're like that. Mm, I probably wouldn't hurt. With a core device. The doctor, you numb the system. We don't Just know. prep the device. What, 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 that device? No! No! You're a goddamn doctor! Yes, Stop. and I intend to faithfully execute my responsibilities. Try not to move and only make things worse. No! Fuck you! Ah! Ah! The pain you would be in. He's on one health. And he's Doctor, he's flatlining. Injector. I can feel the heartbeat of him in the controller. That's so cool. I love like neat little things like that because it just it just adds on to the immersiveness of the game. It's like amnesia. Amnesia is something for that. To just make you feel everything in your control room because you can hear and feel your heartbeat. It just, oh my god. This is Dead Space vibes. You can hear speaking and whispering and psychotic thoughts, and there's nobody out there. That's already destroyed, so that's not a good sign. Nothing's on fire yet, though. Okay. 
See, that's the little box that uh, that female dropped at the start of the game in the cutscene. Is it me, or does he look so much like cleaner with no hair? There is nothing to fear. Right, so I've only played about probably about 10 minutes past this part. Other than that, everything is new to me. And because I know full well that I can fix any issues that I have with this video it is now on the up and up for this series but actually going to be able to get it running so I know we've got to go down these stairs he's obviously quite literally turning you can see that just by the noise he made as well hey man over here hey man hey man what the fuck is going on? Right, Riff. Ah, My ship crashed. I got thrown in here, and then I woke up to this. Well, look, look, look. You're that pilot they just brought in, yeah? Yeah, well, look, I've been in here half my life. I know this place. I've got a plan to get out. If you help me out of this cell, I'll help you, yeah? But you can use this to get inside a control room across that bridge. You can open my cell from there. Okay. Jacob, don't lose it, Jacob. I just saved your life. Let's take don't Elias' you shiv. Right, let's get going over here. Let's go. Oh. Right, let's cut this open. Bang. Another little shimmy. Through then. Jesus. So, through here. Oh shit. So I just got past at this point in this room, like, on the last video that I made. Before decent happened. Right, can you see anything through here? No? Let's go. Oh shit. Let's open this up. Oh, oh! That's literally like Mike Tyson, like bobbing and weaving. That is right there. Oh! Bang! Oh! Straight. Like that's so brutal. Bang! 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 Oh! Pierce straight through the hand. And he's over the rail. So brutal. So brutal. Where did he come from then? Just straight decapitation. Oh, there we go! He's hitting me a bit. Got no arm though. Right, so I saw this. That this is what you need to do. Is you need to press Y to get some health. Right, so let's open Elias' cell. That should do it. Right, so Elias' cell is open. Right, okay. Well, I tell you now, like on the, on the first run of this, like I died, like on the very next bit, like I must have had about like less than two bars of health left. Mate, that robot means business. Right. So for this. Jacob, over here. This gate's no good. Console's not responding. Back there, I just saw something. It attacked me, and it, it didn't seem human. What do you want about? I know what I saw. Yeah. Well, that's definitely not odd. His audio just went. 
Okay, so that's 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 a bug. Got it. His audio just went like he wasn't speaking. Okay. Can I do anything to him? No. Right, coming in, Briv. I died to this fellow. Yeah, he uh, he killed me quite easy. Like first time, he just completely that was it annihilated me. Oh, around here. They have got some very cool sounds though. That's one thing I will say. Like the the actual noises that the monsters make is like quite, you know what I mean, demonic. And it, it does sound sick. So we'll end the episode at the exact same point that I ended it last time. And then the very next episode will be entirely fresh and new for me. So obviously the pacing of it will be a little bit slower. So I do apologise to everybody that's watching this episode if the pacing wasn't exactly uh, slow enough or you wanted me to go a little bit slow. The very next episode will be that way. Right, here we go. He wants it, he wants it, he wants it. Oh. oh, I had clean off. Any healing job? No, just cl just some Callisto credits. There and there. Okay. I wonder what caused the outbreak. So this is a health injector. So this is how we get health. So to get health, you just hold down on the D-pad. Right, there we go. So we are now officially caught up with exactly where I was last time. Wait, is that another one you can get in there? Is it let you? No. And... Peace. There we go. Right. Well... Thank you very much for watching. From this episode out, everything is entirely new to me. So, my commentary will be authentic, and the way that I will be reacting to the game will be authentic. With that being said, I did hope you enjoyed the episode. I did hope you got a little bit of an insight into the game and what it's like. And I will catch you in the next one. Sweet.